Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. So we have so many promotional images for Wizards Tales of Arcadia and a high resolution version of the Wizards Tales of Arcadia poster that was leaked before. We have it all and we have plot details and we have a release date. So let's get into all the images in this video. All right, first image is the Wizards poster. First and foremost, August 7th. It's coming out on August 7th. Duxy, this Duxy in the middle. And then on the right is Troll Jim. But there's actually a lot to talk about with Troll Jim because he has new armor and a new sword. Look at that. That is not a sword that he's ever had before. Look at that thing. And then we got Toby. Toby is probably my favorite character in Tales of Arcadia. I'm so excited to see him in, in this series. And then we got Claire. Claire, there's, so, there's a lot to talk about with Claire here. She has a completely new hairstyle. Uh, it looks like half of her hair is white now. She has a new outfit. And then up here, we have Steve Palchuk, the Palchuk himself. He has brand new armor and an axe that kind of looks like the Star Trek logo, to be honest. And then we got Blinky with his broom. I, I guess... I guess the broom is his weapon now for some reason. And then over here, we got Archie. And it's confirmed on Twitter that Archie is actually Duxie's shape-shifting familiar, which is kind of what I predicted. And then right here, oh my god, I gotta zoom out. Look at this guy. I don't know who he is. We've got these bad guys here with uh, some sort of staff with a with a red gem on it. This new character, I don't, I don't know what she's about, but look at what she's holding. She's holding a scath rune. Morgana's coming back, folks. Morgana is coming back for sure. Of course, there's Bular. And then we've got King Arthur. Yes, King Arthur, ruler of Camelot, is in this series. He kind of looks like the Burger King, to be honest. <laughs> and then we've got Merlin. Uh, nothing's changed about his armor or anything, but that's pretty much everything that is in this poster. Next image is, um, this one with Merlin and Duxy riding horses, and of course Archie th is there too. Honestly, the detail on these characters is so well done. It probably took so long for them to give them so much detail. Like, look at that. All of the detail here is just so impressive. Next image is this one. Featuring a brand new character uh, named Callista. Callista is apparently a troublemaker troll. Next image. Um, this one's very interesting. Okay, first off, let's point out the small details. Uh, <laughs> look at this. Look at this composition. This is just so great. I love this. Uh, this is going to be the best series ever with, with this kind of composition. There's Steve looking awesome with his new axe. His armor looks very cool. Like, he looks like a warrior right now. And it looks like Claire has new lighting effects on the on her armor. Her armor doesn't usually glow like this. So I wonder if, like, if she has magic now. That would be crazy. And then there's King Arthur right there looking awesome. And Merlin. Oh, and another thing I want to mention. There's a pixie capsule there wonder what that's about. Now let's go over to this image. Is a smaller resolution. I'm sorry. I don't I there's nothing I can do about it. This character kind of like she has the same outfit as Claire in the poster, as you can see here. It's the same outfit, but in this image, it looks like she's younger. It's like like some sort of younger version of Claire, or maybe it's a different character. That kind of looks like Claire. All right, now we've got this image. Um, this is very interesting because you can see that Dukes is actually doing magic. It looks like he is creating a gate to stop the bad guys out, out there. This place looks super cool, and it looks like a old-timey version of Hearthstone Troll Market, and it just looks so aesthetically pleasing. Next image. This one confuses me a lot. Uh, I don't know who this character is. I think that, uh, yeah, that's definitely the same person as in the poster here. Same outfit, same hair, yeah, same person. But, what I'm confused about is this character. Is this Claire? Is this like younger version of Claire? It looks like it, 
Or maybe this is just a random princess. I don't even know. I don't even know. Because that's the same outfit as what Claire is wearing in the poster. But who... It, it, did she become younger? I don't even know. Because, like, that's not that's not her height. She is not that short. And why is the shadow staff shorter than it should be? All right, last image that we're going to be looking at is this one. We have Vendel and Drawl in this image. And look at Drawl. He has both of his hands. It looks like Dictatius has his eyesight back. All three of these characters definitely came from the past. 100%. And look at look at this staff. It's completely different from what Vendel usually used. Like th that's a pointier staff. That's all the images. Uh, let me know in the comments what you think of all these images. Let's get on to the articles that were written. I will be going in a lot of detail about this um, article by Variety if it wants to load. All right. So this is the article by Variety.com that basically tells us about the release date and some plot details and the full cast. The DreamWorks animation series tells the story of wizard in training Duxie and other heroes of Arcadia on time travel adventure that takes them to the medieval realm of Camelot. Wizards brings the trilogy full circle, says Del Toro. It's a show that explores the origins of the entire mythology and also an adventure that moves everything, propels it into the future. We reunite with old friends and get to understand old foes. Returning cast members, look at all these. And um, if you guys didn't notice, you probably did, but Arg is not in any of the images. But the voice actor is in the cast. So, Arg's coming back. Wizards follows the time-honored tradition of many trilogies in that the concluding chapter returns to settings, characters, and concepts established in the first, says showrunner and executive producer Mark Guggenheim, the guy that, that basically leaked the poster in the first place. At the same time, however, Wizards is very much its own animal, drawing on characters from both Troll Hunters and Three Below and placing them in a completely new environment that is actually old, Camelot. Although Wizards is the shortest of the three series at 10 episodes, I'm blown away by the amount of, uh, of story we were able to push in this season. The narrative literally spans centuries and contains some of the most emotional content of the entire trilogy. Wow, okay, so there's only 10 episodes. Only 10 episodes in the entire season. So, in the entire series, there's only 10 episodes. And they're probably going to be 23 minutes. And I know this might disappoint a lot of you, but to me, like, I'm thinking, like, you'd be surprised at how much you can fit in 10, 23-minute episodes. You can fit a lot. You can fit a lot of narrative, as long as you keep the story going, as long as you keep it fast-paced. Like, you can fit a lot of world-building and everything into 10 consecutive episodes. So that's all the news that we have about Wizards Tales of Arcadia. There's another article from the Animation Magazine, but it basically covers the same stuff. So that was a lot of information that we just unpacked there. But I'm predicting that next week... We will get the trailer. Thank you guys so much for watching. Get subscribed so you can see my reaction firsthand of the trailer. Um, and like this video if you liked it. Dislike it if you dislike it. I hope you don't dislike it because if you do dislike it, please give me constructive criticism so I can make my videos better so you do like it. Anyway, <laughs> thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye!